Hi, I'm back. I got another jar. <laughs> okay, and on top. Okay, we have this here, which is, I went ahead and took the tape off because you guys probably don't like watching me uh, peel the tape off. This bracelet, yeah, DCJ, so probably somebody whose name is in it. It's nice, feels nice, a little dirty. Probably clean it up with some rubbing alcohol. Mainly the letters, they're dirty. Let's see what happens, shall we? Shall we try? Yes, let's try it to clean it up. See what happens. It's leather. That's why I'm using alcohol. It evaporates quickly. Not like Nice. Oh, that didn't really do anything. So, oh well. At least it doesn't feel as bad. Yep, put that over there. By the alligator. He's the acoustic. I haven't finished him. <laughs> we got this here. Broken. Big chunky beads. Plastic. That's here. Be able to do something with that. That is kind of neat. I put together. Um, there. Some more of these. Okay, here we go. Just need to get a kind of brass or copper colored thing, and that would go nice. Let's see what do we got over here? Come on. Another one here. This one here. I like here because that's the flat side. That would be nice. Just need a couple of O-rings. I got plenty of those after the one thing there. It's kind of nice. I like it. It's weird. <laughs> but I can fix that. It's easy. That's an easy fix. Over there. Alrighty, we got this here. Oh, this is kind of nice. Looks like it's a little twisted. It's crocheted. Okay, you crocheted little seed pearls into it that are pink. So cute. Kind of like it. I do this. I like it. Okay, there we go. This here, I think. And there. I'm not even about to try it. Let's see if I can get it over my hand. Let's see. That's nice. And if you put it like that, that's still nice. It's nice. Feels nice too. So it's nice and soft. I like it. Be better if it was blue. <laughs> Just saying. Blue is better. Alrighty, but I do like that. Yeah, we have a let's have a brooch. Kinda dirty. Back side. Looks like it. Black and white. Let's see if we can clean this off some. Da -da -da -da. Clean, 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 clean. If you don't like watching me clean them, just say so, okay? And maybe I'll quit. I like to clean them so I can see what they look like. And I'm not the most patient person in the world, so, yeah. <laughs> Though I keep telling my kids they need to learn patience. Because they're going to spend a lot of time waiting. They don't seem to believe me. Okay, that's nice. A ribbon. Right. Nice. Get some pink stretchy bracelet. Plastic beads. I think those are plastic too. Yeah. 
you're on plastic. Looks dirty. It's not bad. Depends on what you're doing. Here we go. Alrighty, we got to hang over here. Uh, set. Set. Okay. There we go. Alrighty. Okay, earring kind of bent out of shape. And that feather design on it. I'm not sure what that there is. Could be shell. Let's see what happens if we clean it a little. This is the back side. I'm not going to try it on the part where the feather's painted. Don't want to take the feather off. But no. It does kind of look like pearl. And again, it could be plastic. I don't know. We got an earring. We'll put that over there in case we come across the other one. Now we have a broken thingy. Hmm. What do we have here? Alrighty, we have this. Ooh, I bet. Might have got broken in the jar. Looks like it goes... Together like that. I wonder if I can glue that together. I have UV resin. I have a UV light. Shall we try? Yeah, let's try. Not that I have the slightest idea what I'm doing. Just so you know. Put that on there. Let's see if I can get this here. Just real quick. Just somehow. Honestly, I really don't expect this to work. If it does, I'm going to be surprised. Seriously, I would be surprised. Oh, that looks really pretty under this light. Especially those little blue bubbles. They just glide up. They're terrible. I love it. And two little crystals. I can put whatever I want in there. Because I don't know what goes there. And I do have some pink. I also have some green ones. I get them. Alrighty there. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Seriously, that is a gorgeous cross. I like that. We'll put this over here. We don't want it to get broke again. I'm surprised that worked, actually. <laughs> How about you? Do you guys ever try crazy things like that? <laughs> this is way stretched out. This here, the plastic, those shell beads. I think the shell. We could do something with that. What do you think? Pretty sparkles. Oh, that's missing one. So, luckily, the clear ones like this you can get on Amazon in bulk. So, just gotta figure out the size we need, huh? I have up to five millimeter <laughs> ones of yours. So let's take it. 
and it appears to be about six millimeters. So I'll have to get new ones for that. Let's look at this. It still has all the prongs, so that should that should be fixable quite easily. But the, I still have this one here from another jar that I need to get fixed. I think it's a choker. And it has pink ones like that. It still has all of its prongs there. I don't remember what size are these. And these are five millimeter. Five millimeter one of that, and that would be fixed too. And I have this one here that I want to fix. It's in another jar too. Missing two of these little the big round ones right there and right here and these are these here are also six millimeters for that I can get some for this one here too and fix that because this is I'm sorry it's gorgeous I love it clasp it was sitting over here I have another one that I needed to fix too that I thought I'd show you as in another one too. It's this one here, but it just needs the small beads. But again, absolutely gorgeous. But it's the clear crystal, so you can do that. Can't use the cubic zirconians I got because they're a little bit brighter than those. A little more sparkly, so they don't quite match. So I need to get the regular rhinestones. I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just eight. But it is really pretty. Okay, so I like them. It's sitting on my desk. I'm going to mess with it. <laughs> this here. Next video is going to be a painting video. I just haven't decided what media <laughs> to paint in. I like arting. <laughs> do, you, do you guys like arting? I do different types of painting. Oh, look at the design on that. It's Villagey, I think. Villagey? Villagey? We have something? I don't know. It's pretty. Not a real pearl. It's too smooth. But it's pretty. Got a little C clasp. Here. Much else. But it is really nice. It's a pretty necklace. And we got all of this. Yes, that came out. Ooh, I missed this. How could I forget miss this? It's blue. Seriously, it's blue. Good chain. These are little metal beads, it looks like. I wonder if they're magnetic. Magnet, magnet, magnet. Oh, that part is. Yeah, they're magnetic. But I like it. It's blue and black. I haven't seen one made with metal. Little tubular. Little square tubular. Can it be square and tubular at the same time? I don't know. Little square tubes. I like it. It's kind of nice. It's kind of simple. Kind of beachy vibe to it, I think. What do we have it now? Let's see. Oops. A tangle. International Law of Chords. 
I guess it goes for necklaces too. If it can be tangled, it will be tangled. However, I have never had my Christmas lights tangled. <laughs> Never had one this tangled either. <laughs> now, the monitor parts at work, oh my god, I don't know how the nurses get them that tangled. I think they deliberately tie them in knots, honestly. <laughs> Sometimes, I know they don't, because they like me too much. Sometimes it's like really hard to make sense. And then again, maybe it's Casper. He does like to cause problems. It's a hospital, yes, there's a Casper. Whether you believe in him or not, there is a Casper. Ooh, this is long. Look at how long that is. It's colorful. I like all these little beads. They're different colors. Look at those. We'll see beads. These are strange, but I like those beads. Those are gorgeous. Huge. And makes me think of 1920s flappers. Necklace. It's so long, but I like it. I don't know what I'd wear it, but I do. It's a four. I don't think I'll wear it to the wedding. I have other things I'm thinking about that. I might ask you guys later. <laughs> okay, let's see. Where should we put this? So it doesn't get all tangled. Okay. Right, and we have this thing. This is another a pretty good length one. Don't have time in my foot to put it on. These are interesting. I don't know why I like them. Silver one. I guess this would be a gunmetal. And a gold one. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of nice. I like to like it. As Princess Casserole said, that one would probably be nice for layering or something. I don't really like layering, but you could do there, but I like it. It's pretty yeah, monster class. And then pretty. <laughs> Oop, earring, kind of dirty. Yeah. Yes, I like to I was cleaning them before I started doing the jars, so I'd have something to clean them with anyway. I don't see any reason to stop cleaning them. They do get some weird things. I love them. <laughs> things. Chain mail, but I have no idea what it is. Somebody told me it might be a belt. It's a good guess, guess is any. I might need to take some toothpaste to this one. The earring. Put the earring. Okay. Yep. Other stuff over here. Move this necklace here. Monster pearl. Extender. I don't see any writing on it. No, that's just. Is okay. The extender is magnetic. In there, the chain itself isn't. Well, pendant isn't. I have never seen a ball chain this small. I like it. Yeah. Looks 
the back, right? Okay, it is, I think it's just be the light. It looks like a little, I don't know, just a little medallion. It's cute. It's just cute. Oh yeah, I still have the other stuff down here. I keep forgetting. Oh, it looks like whatever this is, is broken. I have these chains here. Not the same length either. Still has the lobster claw. So if I could get an O ring and place there with an extender on it, I'd be able to. I don't know if I can get it the same length. I do have some chains that don't have there, so I could take those off of their thing and put it on here. It's fixable. It'll take a little work. Yeah, the little cross, Lord de Lee plastic black things, cross, wing, I like the wing, that's pretty, ring there, that's nice, and you have another Fleur de Lis, cross, yeah, we have a little, and a big cross, Across the Phoenix it's here, it's just got the two. Yeah, I think these two might be missing a floor de lis because they're not in there, but I might be able to find a floor de lis in there. It's kind of interesting, or I can take it apart and make a bunch of other stuff. So this one here, be able to put the other. Where did I put this stuff to mix? Uh uh, this going over there. Ooh, I have this here, and I think I have another one like this. I think I know one more. Oh god, to clean it up. Oh, look on my uh, single earring jar. <laughs> Not, I do kind of sort this stuff out every day off. There we go. Clean, 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 clean. It's a cute little swirly. I like it. Let's see. Brass. Kind of more like a bronze there. Let's see. Put all the ones with the danglies on the outside. So let's see. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's it. I could sworn I had one over in there. Ah, here it is. Wookie. Get matches. Let's clean this one up. And then it can go in the matching earring jar. You know, hang on the outside of it. <laughs> Rim of the jar is too wide. <laughs> yes, I thought of that when I picked that jar for it. <laughs> clean, 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 clean. And it works. Oh, uh, Thing. Looks like we have both of these. One slightly more tarnished than the other. Eh. Probably just needs more cleaning. Or toothpaste.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did that. I use rubbing alcohol and toothpaste. <laughs> And the only jewelry I ever had had to directions were the black hills. And it said use toothpaste. And then I'll toothbrush. So that's what I do for most everything. These are pretty. I like that. That is really pretty. Oh, speaking of chain. Yeah, yeah. I have a chain. Peace. It's got a knot in it. Let's see if we can knot out. Building these things. It's a fish hook. That's nice. Let's go with the key ring. And if it's metallic, or magnetic, I meant it's metallic, obviously. One looks silver. I don't know why it might be, but I don't have any way of testing. So. I don't know. Nice bracelet. Ooh, this is pretty. I like this. It's a little loose. It needs to be very strong. But that's doable. I can do that. It's got little mint colored daisies. I love it. It matches my car. <laughs> it does. It matches my car. I got a necklace that matches my car, too. Okay, we got an earring here. It's punched out or something. Let's see if we can clean this up a bit. Probably really need to take some toothpaste to it. It's kind of grimy. Like it might be brass or brass alloy. I don't know if it's magnetic. So let's see. Go with the safety pin. Okay, not brass. <laughs> okay. Go with the 
things. Ooh, how did I miss this one? This one's cute. It's cute. I like it. I don't care if it's for a little girl. Kid, I'd wear it. <laughs> no marks. Okay, it's so cute. Okay. Not magnetic. I hope the other one's in there. I would wear that to work. I would. So here, we got the other one of that. So I'll clean this one off a little bit too. Yep, don't mind that. So we got both of those. Got a little ring. Oh, that is pretty. It's purple. Does not appear to say anything. It's purple. Get two little white crystals. Let's try this again. Okay, that is not. And so let's just. Yeah, that is pretty. Okay, I gotta go. Sorry about that. Uh, they were calling to check on, see how my 